In this guide, you'll learn about the different file systems and how to format your internal or external drive. Four common file systems used are FAT32, XFAT, XT4, and NTFS. Let's quickly go over them. FAT32 works with practically every operating system, but only supports a maximum single file size of 4 gigabytes. Another limitation is that USB flash drives and SD cards larger than 32 gigabytes in size can't be formatted in the FAT32 file system in Windows. XFAT was created to solve the 4GB limitation and replaces the FAT32 file system. You'll find it on SD cards and USB flash drives larger than 32GB. XFAT is fully supported on Windows and Mac computers. XT4 is a file system used on Linux. It's very robust with single file support up to 16TB using a standard 4KB block size. NTFS is the default file system created by Microsoft for hard drives and SSDs using newer Windows versions such as Windows 10. In most cases, you want to use NTFS for drives in Windows. Apple Macs can read NTFS drives but are unable to write to them. First thing to be aware of when formatting a drive is that it wipes all data. So, back up anything important on your drive before going ahead with it. It also means selecting the correct drive for formatting is extremely important. The easiest way to format a drive in Windows is to go to your file explorer. Right click the drive and click format. Here we can see the default file system is NTFS, in that it's the only file system I can choose on Windows 10 for an internal drive. With different types of drives, you'll get different options. Allocation size you shouldn't need to mess around with unless you have a specific reason and you can also choose the name of your drive here. Once ready, click start. A quick format doesn't take long at all. For an external USB drive 32GB or smaller, the FAT32 option is available if you need to use the drive on other operating systems. Another option is to use disk management in Windows. Right click the Windows button and choose disk management or right click this PC in the file explorer and access disk management that way. Find the correct drive and right click format. Here you can name the drive and select the available file system. The final option we're exploring is using disk part to format a drive. In the Windows search bar, type disk part and select it. Type list disk and hit enter. Now you need to select your drive. If you don't know what it is, you can check in disk management using the previous step. Only proceed if you know which disk it is. My external drive is this one. So I type select disk, the corresponding number and then enter. Type list partition and hit enter. Select partition and the number. Hit enter. Finally, we can format the drive by typing format, fs equals and the file system. In this case, it's FAT32 and then type quick. Hit enter. Disk part will let you know when the process is completed. You can then type exit and hit enter to quit. If you're still having trouble formatting your drive, the easiest way to solve most issues is with the EaseUs Partition Master. It's a simple and powerful way to format your drive. You can easily format external drives to different file systems and even format USB drives larger than 32GB to FAT32. Yes, we can bypass the Windows limitation. To download EaseUs Partition Master, follow the link in the description below. Once installed, open Partition Master on your PC. Locate the disk you're trying to format, right click and format. Name the drive, click OK. It will save the action and wait for you to click execute to start it. If you've got formatting errors in Windows and Partition Master, right click the partition on the drive, choose Advanced and then check File System. Make sure the Try to fix errors if found option is ticked. 
the software will handle the rest. It's very easy and intuitive to use. I hope this guide has helped you format your drive successfully. Thanks for watching, like or subscribe, share or comment, and see you next time. Bye for now.